everybody, Joe Workman here, and today I'm really excited because I'm releasing something that is going to be a free update to Total CMS and Impact users, and it's an integration between the two products. And I am really excited about this because it really shows the power of what Total CMS can do for us and how it can b help us build a platform for other stacks and how we can really leverage online managed content to the fullest, right? I mean, prepare to be blown away because this is, I mean, I'm still flabbergasted that this is so cool and possible. Um, so let's jump in and look at it. So here we have a page that has impact. That is a full scaled um, slideshow. But what's really cool is that all of the images and all of the text that is overlaid on those images is 100% managed by a total CMS gallery. And this just boggles my mind. And if this isn't cool enough, if we scroll down, we'll see that we have another instance of impact on this page. And this instance of impact isn't managed by a gallery, but it's managed by a total CMS feed. Impact is actually going and getting the featured image from a post and then overlaying the text for that post on top of it. I mean, this really gives us a such an elegant way of displaying our content that is inside the CMS. It really breaks down the walls of, of the limitations that the CMS does ship with, right? I mean, this, I think the, the feed displays and the galleries that ship with the CMS are awesome. But the fact that we can take that data and use other third-party stacks to leverage it is very, very powerful. And this really couldn't be any easier to use. Let's jump into edit mode and see how easy this was. So here in edit mode, I have two instances of the impact stack. Now, this has all of the default settings. I'm not gonna review this. Go ahead and check out the impact videos for more information on impact. But when you have total CMS installed and impact installed, when you click on the plus button for impact, you will see a new slide option when total CMS is installed. Again, if you don't have Total CMS installed, you will not see this option. So if you have Total CMS installed, you will see a Total CMS impact slide option. And that is exactly what we have shown here. And let's look at the settings. So here for the Total CMS impact slide, you'll see that we have a source and you can choose gallery or feed. You then define the CMS ID for that gallery or feed. Okay, then you define a maximum number of items. So how many items do you wanna pull in from that gallery or feed? And then the sorting, do you wanna get the four newest, the four oldest, or shuffle? So basically get four random items from the feed or gallery. Now the content, by default it's set to none. And when you set your content to none, this will not display any text on top of the images. You will get just an impact slider with the images. Now for galleries, it's probably best if you choose headings or a paragraph, because what happens is it will use the alt tag for an image, and then it will display that alt tag as a header or whatever you've defined here. Okay, now if you wanna type in markdown into your alt tags, you can do that. And then you can actually use your content as markdown. And that's very powerful as well. Now, when you choose thumb on mobile, what this will do is it will actually use the dynamically generated thumbnails that the CMS creates and use those images on mobile devices. This allows us to really optimize our sites for mobile because it will actually use the smaller generated thumbnails on mobile devices. Now, if we've defined uh, content to be displayed, all the settings inside foreground content allow us to style that content. 
So in the style, we have default, okay, which is going to inherit from the theme. And then we have alternate and swatches, which are all foundation site style settings. So you're going to need foundation for these, okay, if you want to use these styles. Now, if you choose custom, you can then define the exact color that you want for your content, okay? Then we have alignment, so your text alignment. Um, content, do you want to customize the font size or do you want to actually also have a container around your content? So do we can actually have a box with a background color and padding and so on and so forth. And then further down here, this is where you define the actual alignment. And these alignment settings are exactly what you see and use inside the existing uh, impact image slides. Now there's something really cool actually, uh, and we'll look at that with this uh, feed. If you notice in this impact stack, I set the total CMS impact slide to be a feed. And then I set the container and if you remember, that container was used and it was set to be the entire right-hand side of the container. Now, if you notice here, I have fill mode set to mobile. And let's see exactly what that does. You'll notice that on tablet and desktop, okay, I have my content and it's taken up a maximum width of 500 pixels, okay? But as I shrink down to mobile size, what you'll notice is the content fills the entire container. This allows us to really, um, you know, display our content properly so that it's not squished on mobile. And you could turn on fill mode for tablet and desktop as well. So that integration is really powerful, right? I mean, this makes me really excited because as I said before, it really illustrates how Total CMS is really a platform that we can tie into with other stacks. And impact is beautiful. It gives us some really amazing layouts. So if you don't have impact and you're using total CMS, maybe you can use impact to, you know, have a different way of displaying your galleries or a different way of displaying your feeds, right? I mean, it's very exciting how we can take content that is managed by the CMS and really just make it beautifully integrated into another stack. I'm really excited about this. I can't wait to see how you use it and how it really makes your websites beautiful because I know it's going to because impact is stellar. And the way we manage content with Total CMS is awesome, right? So it's stellar awesome. <laughs> anyway, I hope you enjoy this integration. It's awesome. Um, I'm, I'm still blown away by it. Uh, I think it's just the bee's knees. So take care, everybody. I hope you like it and go forth and make your websites great. Bye.